It poured into Joby Laflamme's basement like a waterfall, August 9th, just after 6.30. Everything was floating, like freezers were floating, fridge was floating, big couches were floating, everything was floating, it was nuts. Like so many other homeowners, it was a mad dash to save anything. We were just trying to grab all personal effects to bring it upstairs and get it upstairs and get it out of here. And since then, he's been dealing with his insurance company, often waiting days for a callback. And if you're hoping for your insurer to find you a contractor, you might be out of luck. CTV has learned that insurance companies are telling people to find their own workers, and those workers are already bogged down. Many homeowners may not have a contractor to renovate their basement until 2025. The Insurance Bureau of Canada tells CTV that insurance companies are not legally obligated to find you a contractor. See the water level right about here. Contractor Mike Senecal says he's been working non-stop all month. You can't keep up, not with the volume that's out there. You can't keep up. He says insurance companies are giving their clients a check to pay for the work. The problem is the money doesn't come quickly. They're not getting the 20000 right away. That's why the retainer comes in. I have no choice. I can't work and not be able to pay my, our staffs. Walter Assi from Renovco says his teams have not taken a day off since the flood. Uh, we've received something close to 3,000 calls now. Uh, so that's how busy we are. We're trying to get to as many people as possible. He says people should not wait until 2025 to demolish and decontaminate their basements. At least from a demolition, decontamination, cleanup, drying perspective, you shouldn't even wait days, let alone weeks and months. He points out there was a miscommunication between some insurance companies and their clients. Hey, we got a second wave now of calls. Uh, of people that are fed up from waiting, of people that finally heard back from the insurance companies, and now they're in panic mode because, you know, they have mold and they have all kind of damages in their homes. With contractors swamped, don't be surprised if your basement remains unfinished for months. Matt Grillo, CTV News.